Hello out there, gorgeous souls. It is Rochelle here with Empowerment Experiences, and I am so excited, grateful, and blessed to be guiding you into and through finding your power in every moment. On today's video, I am going to share with you my worthiness practice that I actually implement to connect with, align with, and amplify my worthiness. And it's called a practice because it's definitely something you wanna practice regularly, especially when we've all been socially conditioned to believe we're not worthy, we're not good enough, we're not pretty enough, we're not smart enough, all the not enoughness in the world, right? It's time to shift all of that madness, okay? And I am here to help you do exactly that. Let's jump right in. Again, this is called the worthiness practice, and I recommend that you have a spot where you can actually lay down. Where we are right now, just so you know, is this is actually my office. This is my massage table that I've had forever. It's actually from my former life profession of what I used to do um, as an adult entertainer. Yes, uh-huh. Got you intrigued now, right? <laughs> but I utilize it now in my office because when I'm sitting there working and it's so easy, I start to catch myself now I'm very, very good at catching myself right away when I start to feel the walls closing in, which means I start to feel my, my energy tighten up. I start to feel myself um, get tense, stressed, overwhelmed, frustrated. I start to just feel my, my shit get all wonky, literally. <laughs> and that's when I can literally just stop what I'm doing and come right around my desk and lie down and meditate or... Um, or do any of these uh, mindset practices or energy practices that like what I'm about to show you here. Again, this is just a simple worthiness practice and you can do it anytime. You don't have to be lying down. It's something that you can do standing in an elevator, driving in your car, um, sitting at a restaurant, waiting, waiting in a waiting room even, okay? Uh, but this is the, the one space that I have come to find that allows me to be fully, fully present is right here and right now. Because only right here and now can you ever find and connect with your power. So let's do that right now. All right. So to start, let's just, oh, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to walk you through this, okay? I'm going to don't worry, I'm holding your hand energetically, okay? You are not alone in this, okay? So I want you to just lie back and I want you to just kind of oh, shift yourself out of, out of that tension and, and get to where you're feeling perfectly comfortable and you're all settled in there, whether it's on a massage table, on your bed, on the sofa, on the floor is an amazing place to be. Oh, outside and some grass. Oh, that sounds amazing right now. Get yourself comfortable. For now, we're gonna start with just our hands, each to the side, palms up. I just want you to start to relax just a little bit. Start to feel all of that tension fall away. Start to feel more and more present in your body right here, right now. I want you to start to focus on your breath. Start to be intentional with it. Intentional with your focus, intentional with your breath. I want you to inhale deeply through your nose. And exhale slowly out your mouth. I want you to do it again. Inhale deeply in your nose. Exhale slow and steady out your mouth. Let's do that one more time. Inhale. And exhale. So first, 
I have my left hand. I place it on my lower abdomen. Energetic connect with, energetically connect with my sacral chakras and my root chakra. And why the left hand there? Because it's the side of my body that is closest to my heart. And then I take the right hand and I place that over the space in between my heart and solar plexus chakras to unify that energy. And I want you to take a big deep breath in and raise those hands high in your body. exhale and inhale again and exhale at this time I'd like you to just smile smile for for no other reason than it feels good to smile. It feels really, really good to smile. Keep breathing. Keep smiling. And breathe. And this is when I begin to say aloud, I am worthy and deserving of all of my desires. Smiling as you say that. I am worthy and deserving of receiving all the abundance that I seek. Keep smiling and breathing. I am worthy and deserving of all the love I so readily give to others. I am worthy and deserving of all the joy I yearn to experience in this life. And with each and every one of these declarations that you choose to state, Keep smiling. And I want you to focus. Focus inward. Focus on the I am inside you. Because that is you. That is all you. And there's only one you. There only ever will be one you and that makes you more priceless than the most rare gem on this entire planet but there will never be nor has there ever been another you As you lay here, keep smiling. Keep feeling that worthiness, that deservedness, that joy, that love, that abundance. Feel the energy flow throughout your body from one hand to the other. Almost like a liquid plumber for your internal pipe, pipes. Allow for this 
incredible energy to flow through you and know that that you are that energy and that you are connected with that energy and that that energy is is the all and everything that is in this universe it is love and you are love and love in itself is worthy love in itself is deserving so declare I am worthy and deserving because I am love I am worthy and deserving because I am abundance I am love manifested. I am worthy and deserving of feeling worthy and deserving. And just keep smiling. Keep feeling good, keep letting yourself be in that space, in that energetic space. The longer you can be connected with it, the longer you will experience it. And the easier that it will be for you to recognize love, for you to be able to tune into it and tap into it and allow that to be your dominating point of attraction. And then and only then will you find yourself attracting into your realm of experience all the things that you once thought were so far out of reach because for once you finally come to see that it's always been inside you. Everything you desire is already within. It's up to you to align with it. I love to turn on some self-love enhancement meditation music. In fact, I'm going to link my favorite one here in the description. So that once you complete this video tutorial with me, you can continue on your own journey. Just keep smiling and let's just keep laying here. Doesn't it feel nice to just be, to just be worthy to be deserving that there's nothing more for you to do right now except to just be. Just be with me. Just smile with me. Just breathe with me. I feel good. How about you? I recommend when you complete the worthiness practice for yourself that you get up slowly. You come back into the reality slowly by one hand Remove, remove another hand, or the other hand. <laughs> and maybe lay here for a few moments with both hands up along the side and allow energy to come in through the palms of your hands from the universe. Replenish and restore. Oh. Yeah, 
slowly open your eyes. Uh -huh. So how was it for you? <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now. It's a journey. I don't call it the self-love empowerment journey for nothing. You will experience highs and lows, the mountains and the valleys of that, which is the self-love empowerment journey. Just know that it gets better and better and better. You just keep practicing. You keep holding on. You keep committed to being the change in your own life. And I promise you're already on your way to living a life you love. Just by learning to truly love yourself. I'm Rochelle Richard, founder, CEO, and self-love empowerment coach of Empowerment Experiences. I am here for you. Please reach out. Let's get that bar moving. Let's, let's get you shifting through and expanding into your power so you can really truly begin to create and live a life you love to live. Isn't it your turn? What's going to happen in six months, a year from now, if you don't take the chance? Bar moving. Let's, let's get you shifting through and expanding into your power so you can really truly begin to create and live a life you love to live. Isn't it your turn? What's going to happen in six months, a year from now, if you don't take the chance? to step out of your comfort zone and do something different. Find your brave and book a call because you are empowered as you. I'll see you soon. Go create amazing. The power is and always has been inside you and thus in your hands. Namaste.